Using the color-coded maps workflow, you can select one of the thousands of data variables available in Business Analyst and visualize them on the map. You can easily create a map by selecting from a list of the most popular variables. Simply click on the variable and a map gets created for you. Or you can browse all to find the variable related to your analysis. Here you have the option to choose from a number of demographic, business, and spending data categories. Simply select the category of your interest or search using the relevant keywords. Some variables have toggles that allow you to choose different formats of the data, such as percentages and indices. You can mark variables as favorites to quickly access them again later on. Click the variable to add the selected data to the map. When you drill down to your area of interest by zooming in, the map updates with finer geographic boundaries. Here in the Legends tab, you can change the geographic level manually as well as lock in at a desired level. To focus on a specific range of data, you can filter simply by clicking different categories, or use the filter slider to refine your range. Under the Style tab, you can use a number of mapping options to symbolize data by color and size. Change the color scheme by choosing from a predefined classification. Under the Data tab, you can see the individual records in a table and hover over to locate them on the map. You also have options to sort them by value and name, view them in charts, or export the data for further analysis. Click the pencil icon to map a different data variable. You have options to access variables from favorites, recent lists, or to create a custom variable. Creating custom variables allows you to make new variables and save them for reuse. For example, population data for ages between 19 and 24, or households with income between 32,000 and 44,000. You can use the advanced options to create more complex data. Click Save and Add, which will map the new custom variable and save it for later use. To use a second variable in the same map, click Add Variable and choose the same data browsing workflow. For example, this map shows total population and median income by states in one view. Darker icons show higher income, larger icons show higher population. This map style allows you to explore the relationship between two variables. Click Switch Variables to flip the order of the variables used for color and size symbology. When you're finished creating your map, use the Create PDF button to generate a PDF map that can be printed saved or shared. Thanks for watching.